Hi class, this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to log into Think Central so you can access some online homework and also have your textbook at home at all times. So what you're going to do first is go to your internet browser. If your browser uh, comes up on your home page as Google, that's great. In Google, type in Think Central K6. Press enter. The first thing on top, you'll see Think Central in the website uh, www-k6.thinkcentral.com. That's the direct website. If you wanted to bookmark that or save that, you could. But otherwise, you can just search it in Google, and it will come up as well. So click on Think Central once you find it. And if it's your first time going to Think Central, it's going to ask you, to select your country, state, our district is Woodhaven Brownstown School District, Woodhaven 48183. You can see that here. Then we have our school, Goodith Elementary. This box should be checked so you don't have to keep filling out that information, information. So check that box to remember our school. And then your username and password. I gave this in your Tuesday folder so you have to make sure that you have this piece of paper put in a safe spot if you can't remember it. But for most people it's their first name for their username and the password is their last name with the numbers following 1, 2, 3. So for example, let's log in as Kenyatta, last name Brooks, and the password is Brooks123 after that. So let's log in. So now we are logged in to Think Central, and this is our home page. Every time we come in, you can refer to it as your dashboard, and you have three applications. You have things to do on the left, which is going to be your assignments, their due dates, and the status, meaning if you're working on it or you're done, you can come back and forth to assignments. You'll find your scores of those assignments under this app, so you'd click there. And then your library, this is where some really good math games are and some different activities that you can go to. And I will assign those weekly or every other week to play some games that focus on our skills. So let's click on things to do. Right now everyone should be seeing that they have one assignment. That assignment is Unit 1 Study Guide for the teacher Satterfield and it's your subject of mathematics. There is a due date of October 1st, 2014. So when you're ready to take that test, you click on the assignment, Unit 1 Study Guide. This is a study guide. It's exactly the same format and style test you will have for Unit 1. So I, I, I encourage you to take advantage of that and to make sure you understand those questions because that's exactly what your test is going to look like. Once you complete this, you can go to your scores, which are right here on the left. Click on it. Right now we have no scores because we haven't done any assignments. The library. Let's go there and see what we have. The library, here is your textbook, student edition, grade 5, math expressions, tools. Right here, there's some uh, manipulative, some different kind of blocks and rulers and things to use to understand concepts. And then Mega Math, this is some other games that you can play. So let's see what this uh, student edition looks like. Click on there. Now, if you are using a um, desktop computer, you're going to want to use the Flash eBook. And if you're on a iPad or tablet, you're going to want to use the HTML5. That's what I'm on. I'm on an iPad. So as that loads, you will see the front cover of our Math Expressions Grade 5 book. On the left, you have some little icons, the contents. Click there. You know that we are starting Unit 1, beginning of the year, working on equivalent fractions. And this is introduction to the math board, which we'll be doing day one. That is a lesson. Here's our family letter. You can click all these icons. They'll read it to you. It's a really nice source. So you can play with that as need be. Okay, so I hope this video was helpful. This is uh, Math Central. 
or math expressions, excuse me, that's our program, and the website is K6 Thanks Central. And this is going to be where we post study guides and other assignments to help you on your math.